Uh, this is the book of Luke, chapter 21, verse 11, and it reads through the Holy Scriptures from BibleGateway.com, from KJV, Virgin of the Holy Scriptures, and it reads, And great earthquakes shall be in diverse places, and famines, and pestilence, and fearful sights, and great signs shall there be from heaven. Uh, Shalom, first and foremost, I'd like to give all praises and glory and honor to <clears throat> To Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Wakar Kadash. Double honors to the elders for preaching this word truthfully and sincerely. And Shalom to the uh, Akia, scattered through the four corners of the group, preaching the word truthfully and sincerely as well, too. And I'll say Shalom to you, Akia, uh, out there. And this is a uh, sit down lesson that I want to bring out of this recent news article from the Jerusalem Post. And this is from Reuters, published April 26, 2023, and it reads, Magnitude of a 5.8 earthquake strikes North Island of New Zealand. And keep this in mind, over there in the uh, Paramedic per Islands, if I pronounce that right, where you had the day before yesterday, you know, that was a magnitude of a 7.2 or 7.3 earthquake. You know, that earthquake was uh, kind of close to uh, New Zealand. And then I believe uh, in New Zealand, I got hit with a 7.3 or 7.1 of an earthquake. Now, a day later, they got uh, hit once again with an earthquake. And this in the North Island region of New Zealand. And this was a magnitude of a 5.8 earthquake. And it reads, an earthquake of a magnitude of a 5.8 struck the North Island of New Zealand on Wednesday. The European Mediterranean Simulatory since a Century EMSC says, it says the quake was at a depth of 30 kilometers and 18.64 uh, miles, the EMSC says. And this is the book of uh, Isaiah, chapter 29, verse 6, and it reads through the Holy Scriptures. So, yeah, definitely for sure, so far this year, we're definitely seeing, so far this year, in the year of 2023, we've been definitely seeing an uptick of increasing of these uh, earthquakes in diverse places. And this is the book of Isaiah, chapter 29, and verse 6. Same through the uh, the same uh, area article. I mean, same a area news. I mean, the same area of of uh, the source of BibleGateway.com. As I'm breaking out this scripture from the KJV version of the Holy Scriptures, and it reads, uh, "My apology, kind of slip of the tongue, but this is Isaiah chapter 29 and verse six, and it reads through the Holy Scriptures." Thou shalt be visit of the Lord of hosts with thunder and with earthquake and great noise and storms and tempests and the flame divided fire. So, like I mentioned again, so far this year, in the year of 2023, we've definitely been seeing an increasing uptick in the historical earthquakes of high magnitudes in diverse places. And as we see another earthquake over there in New Zealand, and because you had a earthquake had hit over there, I uh, believe, day before yesterday, and that was a 7.3 magnitude of an earthquake. Now, a day later, a uh, day before later, a day or two later, now you have this new earthquake over there in New Zealand, which is uh, North Island of New Zealand, and this was a 5.8 magnitude of an earthquake. So we're gonna definitely gonna continue to see the uh, increasing and uptick in the historical earthquakes of high magnitudes and earthquakes in diverse places like never before so far in the year of 2023. So with that, hopefully this uh, sit down lesson was edifying of this recent news article from the JerusalemPost.com, uh, published April 26, 2023, by Reuters. As it reads again. Magnitude of a 5.8 earthquake strikes North Island off New Zealand. So with that, 
I would like to give all praises and glory and honor too to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai, Ba'ashem, Bokar Kadash. Double honors to the elders for preaching his word truthfully and sincerely. And Shalom to the Akian, scattered through the four corners of the globe, preaching the word truthfully and sincerely as well too. And until next time, I will say Shalom.